Daniel Allen Maman, born October 25, 1977, professionally known as the Alchemist or simply Alchemist, is an American record producer, disc jockey, DJ, and rapper. He began his music career in 1991 in the hip-hop duo The Hooligans under the moniker Mudfoot, along with now actor Scott Kahn, whose moniker was Mad Skills. After rising to prominence in the late 1990s, as a close associate of Dilated Peoples and Mob Deep, he went on to produce for many of hip-hop's leading artists in the 2000s, and has been hailed as one of the genre's leading producers. He is currently working as a DJ with Action Bronson. He produces for many artists, most of his recent production is for a close group of frequent collaborative rappers. He focuses on producing entire albums for rappers and instrumental projects of his own. Together with his longtime collaborator Oh No, with whom he forms the group Gangrene, Woody Jackson and Tangerine Dream, he composed the official score to the 2013 video game Grand Theft Auto V. Career As a teenager, Maman began to identify strongly with the rebellious lyrics and urban sounds of hip-hop, and he began writing his own lyrics. He joined up with other like-minded artists who wrote lyrics and rebelled against their suburban surroundings. These included Shifty Shellshock of Crazy Town, Evidence and Scott Kahn, son of James Kahn. In 1991, a 14-year-old Maman and Scott Kahn decided to become a duo named the Hooligans. While rhyming at a party in L.A., they attracted the attention of Be Real of Cypress Hill. He invited the teens to join his crew, the Soul Assassins, which also included the group's House of Pain and Funk Dubious. In 1993, the Hooligans released their first single, Put Your Hands Up. The song received little radio airplay and their record label, Tommy Boy Records, decided to shelve their album. Rejected, Scott focused his creative energy on acting while Al became interested in process of making hip-hop beats. DJ Muggs took Al under his wing and taught him how to use a sampler and mixing board. After helping to produce a few tracks for Cypress Hill, Al became the main producer for his childhood friend, Evidence and his group Dilated Peoples. When Dilated Peoples debuted in 1998, they helped promote Maman as a key part of their sound. Alchemist also produced several tracks on the debut album Focused Daily by Defari, another Dilated and Alcoholic affiliate. In 1999, Muggs introduced Al to his good friends, the popular hip-hop group Mob Deep. All produced two songs for their Murder Music album. Impressed by his production skills and street smarts, Mob Deep continued using his beats on all their subsequent albums. As Alchemist's profile increased, he went on to produce for many of hip-hop's most successful and prominent artists, such as Nas, Fat Joe, Jadakiss, Ghostface Killa and Snoop Dogg. He has also remixed songs for bands and artists in other genres such as Linkin Park and Morchiba. All stayed loyal to his old friends, continuing to produce for Dilated, Cypress Hill and Crazy Town. He also enjoys producing for lesser-known underground rappers, often giving them some of his best beats. In 2004, six years after his rapping career folded, The Alchemist put out his debut album, First Infantry. The album yielded the single, Hold You Down, featuring Prodigy, Illa Gee and Nina Sky, which hit number 95 on the Billboard Hot 100 in 2005. Topic Ross Cass feud In 1999, The Alchemist was set to produce three tracks for American rapper Ross Cass then upcoming album Van Gogh, which was scheduled for a late 2000 release at the time. One of the said tracks was Home Sweet Home, which was to be the lead single for Ross Cass' album. After The Alchemist received the first half of the payment for the beat, he said Ross Cass' record label Priority was ignoring him. They later met up in August, at the Source Awards in Pasadena, California, where Alchemist informed Cass that he'd been showcasing the beat to other artists. Jadakiss would then go on to record We Gonna Make It over the same beat, on his 2001 release, Kiss De Game Goodbye. When Ross Cass took notice, he attempted to stop the release by releasing his version of the song on mixtapes, to no avail. This prompted Ross to diss Alchemist in freestyles and on a track from Van Gogh. Eventually, the beef ended so he could concentrate on his legal problems but still cited a loss of respect for the producer. In an interview with www.hiphopgame.com, Ross admitted that he was being stubborn and refused to listen to what The Alchemist was trying to tell him. 
The two have since squashed the beef and Alchemist produced the song Past, Future, and Present and did the intro for the song that appeared on the 2006 mixtape Revenge of the Spit. In 2011, Ross Cass appeared together with rapper Raekwon on fellow rapper Evidence's album Cats and Dogs, on a song called The Red Carpet, which was produced by The Alchemist. Other projects The Alchemist is one of the music producers behind the tenth installment of Grand Theft Auto, Chinatown Wars released by Rockstar Games. He was also on Tim Westwood TV, when Eminem, Royce Da 5 feet 9 inches and Mr. Porter freestyled. During an interview with Worldwide Conspiracy Radio, The Alchemist revealed he would be dropping a two-part project with fellow West Coast producer Oh No Entitled Gangrene, the first to be released in July, the second in November, both on Decon. Alchemist was also the DJ for the Eminem set on the BBC One chat show Jonathan Ross on June 4, 2010. Shady Records Alchemist is Eminem's official DJ, since DJ Green Lantern departed from Shady Records in 2005 because of a dispute related to the feud of 50 Cent and Jadakiss. In 2006, Eminem released a collaboration album with Shady Records called Eminem Presents, The Re-Up. Since The Alchemist is his official DJ, he produced some of the tracks on the mixtape, as well as compiling the album in a mixtape fashion. On December 18, 2013, he was named the runner-up for Producer of the Year by Hip Hop DX. Collaboration projects Return of the Mac 2007 In 2007, The Alchemist and rapper Prodigy came together for a studio album titled Return of the Mac, that was released on March 27, 2007. The album was intended to be a mixtape serving as a prequel to Prodigy's next album, HNIC. PT, 2, but was released as a traditional album due to the unexpected level of quality of the record. The album features songs sampled from the black exploitation era. Return of the Mac debuted at number 32 on the Billboard 200, selling 27,000 copies in its first week. As of December 2007, the album has sold 130,000 copies. The album received notable critical acclaim, and is considered somewhat of a return to form for Prodigy, as many considered him to have fallen off after the 2001 Mob Deep release Infamy. Return of the Mac was supported by three singles with music videos Mac 10 Handle. New York Shit and Stuck on You. The Antidote. 2009. In 2009, The Alchemist produced an entire mixtape with rapper Fashan, called The Antidote. Covert Coup. 2011. The Alchemist and the rapper Curran Dollar Y came together for the mixtape Covert Coup, which was released April 20, 2011. The Alchemist produced the whole mixtape and even released an instrumental version of it. It was rumored that the pair were going to release a sequel to the mixtape, titled, Reconversationalize, which was to be released on April 20, 2012, exactly one year after the first project was released, but this did not happen. In fact, it was proven by Alchemist in an interview that it was all rumors created and developed by the Internet. No Idols 2012 In August 2013, The Alchemist produced Odd Future member Domo Genesis mixtape, No Idols. The mixtape was critically acclaimed upon release and featured guest appearances by Prodigy, Earl Sweatshirt, Tyler the Creator, Action Bronson, Vince Staples, Freddie Gibbs, and Space Ghost Porp. It was later released on a limited edition vinyl. Yacht Rock 2012 In October 2012, The Alchemist and 95 Eyewear collaborated to a project with an Alchemist edition sunglasses, eyeglasses with a 12-minute vinyl with an exclusive mix produced by Alchemist, featuring Action Bronson, Rock Marciano, Ono, oh Big Twins, Chuck English and Blue. It was limited for 400 pieces worldwide. On October 31, 2012, The Alchemist released the project for a free download, in 95's website. Later it was released on a limited edition vinyl. Rare Chandeliers. 
2012, a project titled Rare Chandeliers, a collaboration between Alchemist and Action Bronson, was released on November 15, 2012 as a mixtape. Later an extended version was released, also for free. The mixtape featured guest appearances from Rock Marciano, Styles P, and Sean Price, among others. 360 Waves 2013, The Alchemist collaborated with the group Durag Dynasty which are Planet Asia, Tri-State and Killer Ben that also appeared on his album Russian Roulette, for their debut album 360 Waves. He produced the entire album. The album was released on March 26, after a first video for the first half of the song 360 Waves was released a day before. Later, a video for the second single Fish Meat featuring Prodigy was released on July 29 and a video for the second half of the song was released too on August 19. Albert Einstein 2013 Prodigy's second album with the alchemist, Albert Einstein, was released on June 11, 2013. It featured guest appearances from Rock Marciano, Domo Genesis, Havoc, Raekwon and Action Bronson. It debuted at number 175 on the Billboard 200 chart, with first week sales of 3,000 copies in the United States. The following week it fell off the chart. On February 25, 2014 an extension installment EP for Albert Einstein was released under the name P equals MC Squared Deluxe Edition, that contains four extra songs, produced by Alchemist, of course. Masterpiece Theater EP 2013, The Alchemist produced the Willie the Kid EP Masterpiece Theater EP, which was released for digital download on July 23, 2013. Two singles were released from the album, Halal Tuna and Medusa. My First Chemistry Set 2013, Detroit rapper Boldy James signed a record deal with Decon for an all-alchemist-produced album, that later got the name My First Chemistry Set, and was released on October 15, 2013. Diagnosis 2013 On October 24, 2013, Alchemist released an audio collage for a Coca-Cola and Dr. Romanelli collection of retro-inspired clothing. Called Diagnosis, he said that he was going to flip the script and give out a gift on his own birthday. His birthday is on October 25. Inside the collage is a song featuring Action Bronson and producer Twiz the Beat Pro produced one of the beats. Gangrene on the album Chemical Warfare, there were two songs, named Act of Violence and Under Siege, that were collaborations with rapper Oh No, under the collaboration name Gangrene. Since then the group has released two full projects together, Sawblade EP and the studio album Gutter Water. Following that later in 2011, Gangrene and rapper Rock Marciano released Greneberg EP on July 19, 2011. In January 2012 they released their second full-length LP, Vodka and Ayahuasca, and then in April 2012, Gangrene released a four-track EP called Auditorium EP, for free download on Red Bull USA's official site, and as a picture disc. Grand Theft Auto V Original Score 2013, The Alchemist has collaborated with Ono, Gangrene, Tangerine Dream and Woody Jackson to score the original score for the highly anticipated game, Grand Theft Auto V by Rockstar Games. Lord Steppington, Step Brothers 2014, The Alchemist and fellow rapper Evidence have performed as the duo Step Brothers. Their debut album was announced to be titled Lord Steppington and released on the Rhymesayers Entertainment label. Talking about the album in 2010, Alchemist said, I wanna create a sound for it. I don't want Step Brothers songs to sound like it could have been a dilated people's song, or an Evidence song, that I'd rap on. A release date for the album was scheduled for November 19, 2013, but later the release date was pushed to January 20, 2014. There is also an instrumental version for the album, that was released on vinyl. The Good Book. Gospel Project with Budgie 2014. In an interview for Dead End Hip Hop, Alchemist stated that he had been working on a project related to the gospel. Later, on March 2, 2014 he posted a teaser photo to that project, which will be a collaboration between Alchemist and producer Budgie, and also retweeted a tweet from Frank the Butcher, the founder of Bao, which the project is going to be released on, announcing the project and saying that more information will be released two days after. Later, in March 5, they announced that the project is named, The Good Book, and released the first single, In Heaven's Home, Feet. Rock Marciano and Prodigy. It will come in a well-designed cover in a shape of a Bible book, covered in leather, and will be limited to 1,000. It will be released on March 11. 
The project will include mostly instrumentals and also some raps featuring Prodigy, Rock Marciano, Action Bronson, Blue, A Dollar Ton Matthews, Domo Genesis, Mick Luder, and JROCC. All gospel samples. British Nights, Which Ways the Beach Mix. 2014 On September 10, 2014, Alchemist spontaneously wrote on Twitter that producer Samayam and himself has something to release with Dr. Romanelli that Al previously did something for earlier, the diagnosis mix with Coca-Cola. Later he published a new 8-minute mix of Beats by himself and Beats by Samayam for the shoe brand British Knights. The mix has an Action Bronson verse on an Alchemist beat in it too. Fash Ionably Late 2014, completely by surprise, on December 8, 2014, Alchemist tweeted that he and rapper Fashan are going to release an EP together soon, and gave a link to the first video, single from the album, Dreams, featuring evidence. Fashan tweeted that the reason for this EP is that sample clearances on his upcoming album, The Ecology, were taking too long, and he wanted the fans to have some music to listen to in the meanwhile. He also said that working with Alchemist is always a unique, special and different vibe and experience. The EP was set to contain seven tracks, all produced by Alchemist and to be released on December 18, for free. On the day of the release, a second video was released, for the song, Never Waiting in Vain, last song on the EP. Welcome to Los Santos Gangrene on March 6, 2015, a while after Rockstar Games announced the release of the PC GTA 5, it was announced that Alchemist and Ono Gangrene will have a new radio station called The Lab in the game. In addition to that, a new song, Play It Cool, feat, Earl Sweatshirt and Samuel Herring was released. The song is a part from a new album of tracks inspired by GTA 5 named Welcome to Los Santos that was released on April 21, 2015. The album is a compilation album of new songs from a wide range of artists. The Alchemist and Oh No were involved in the production of the songs, and the album was released for the release of the PC version of the game. You Discussed Me Gangrene on Twitter, Oh No mentioned that the third project by Gangrene the collaboration of Alchemist and Oh No is in the making. Following the release of the Grand Theft Auto V score produced by Alchemist and Oh No, they revealed that their focus was now on a new Gangrene album. In an exclusive interview in the show Jiga Juice in an Israeli radio station 106.2 FM on June 25, 2014, the Alchemist said that the album is almost finalized. On November 7, 2014, Alchemist tweeted again about new Gangrene coming soon and then, director Jason Goldwatch announced that they are making songs and videos more specifically, songs for videos, instead of the other way around. On January 14, 2015, Goldwatch said that the editing of the first video, for a single named Driving Gloves, is done, and the video is coming soon. The video was released on July 17. Gangrene revealed the album title to be You Discussed Me. The album was first released on iTunes, on August 7, 2015, and then on a physical copy a week or so later. Kraft Singles on November 18, Alchemist released a single on his SoundCloud, featuring Mac Miller and Migos, titled Jabroni. Later he said on Twitter that it will be released on limited 45 vinyl single with an instrumental version, as part of a new single series, called Kraft Singles. On February 11, Alchemist announced the dates of release of every one of the four Kraft singles vinyls. The tracks were, Hoover Street original version by Schoolboy Q March 11, 2016, Any Means and Supply by MC8 and Spice One April 8, Cobb and Palisades by Blue May 6 and Jabroni by Migos and Mac Miller June 3. Some of those were already released online and Alchemist released the Hoover Street original version online on the same day of the announcements. On August 11, another song was released, All For It, by Rock Marciano. The Carrollton Heist on January 13, 2016, The Alchemist and Curran Dollar Y announced their second collaboration on Twitter, entitled The Carrollton Heist. The album was all recorded in one day, January 4, 2016, Monday. Later, Curran Dollar Y announced a release date and cover art on his Instagram. The release date was set to February 14, 2016. This second collaboration of Alchemist and Curran Dollar Y was very long awaited since rumors of a covert coup sequel their first collab were floating online back in 2012 until Alchemist dismissed them in an interview. The album was, indeed released on February 14, on Datpiff.
Later, Alchemist noticed that the version there was not the final mastered one, so he uploaded the full mastered version to his SoundCloud page. Rap and Glory Epon March 17, 2016, it was announced that Alchemist and Dutch rapper Kempi will be releasing an EP on April 2, 2016. The EP consists of four tracks and four instrumental versions of them. On March 25, 2016, a mini documentary video was uploaded, showing the making of the EP. The silent partner on March 2, 2016, Havoc posted a photo on his Instagram stating that his next album is produced by Alchemist, and is coming soon. The title was revealed to be, The Silent Partner, and the first single, Maintain, was released later. The album was released on May 20. Fantasy Island Epin December 2016, mixer Eddie Sancho revealed that he's mixing a joint project by Alchemist and rapper Jay Worthy. Much later, in April 2017, The Alchemist revealed the name and June 2nd release date of the project, titled, Fantasy Island EP. The Good Book, Volume 2 The Alchemist teased the sequel to The Good Book Project with producer Budgie on his Instagram story a couple of times. Then, on May 7, 2017, he surprisingly tweeted a link to pre-order the project and a first single, Brother Jedediah, featuring Action Bronson and Big Body Bess. The project was released on July 21. Like the previous good book, it contains two parts, one by Alchemist and one by Busji. Alchemist's part features lyrics from Mob Deep, Westside Gun, Conway, Roy Staw 5 feet 9 inches, Durig Dynasty, Action Bronson and more, as well as beats and some audio collages. Paris, LA, Bruce Ellison September 2017, a hip-hop project was released by Red Bull France. The project consists of eight tracks by rappers from Paris and Bruxelles, Belgium, with Alchemist helming the entire production of the project. Fetty a collaboration between Alchemist, Curran Z and Freddie Gibbs. Fetty was first announced on January 4, 2017, through an Instagram post by Curran Z. On September 21, 2018, nearly two years later, Curran Z announced on Instagram that he had completed his half of the project. In the post, Curran Z is recorded saying, This message is to one Frederick Gibbs. My half of Fetty is done. All produced by Alchemist. Gibbs would publicly respond to the post shortly after, commenting, N asterisk 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 A. Send it. I'm by the booth. On October 25, the tracklist and release date were posted by Gibbs on Instagram. In an interview with The Grinds TV, Gibbs stated that his half of the EP took two days to complete. Within the 19 months following Fetty's initial announcement, Curran Z released 12 projects while Gibbs released Freddy, his fourth studio album. Topic upcoming projects Westside Dumont September 8, 2017, Shady Records newly signed rapper Westside Gun and rapper MF Doom announced that they will be joining forces for an album titled Westside Doom, entirely produced by Alchemist and Westside Gun's longtime collaborator Daringer. No more details were revealed yet. TBT Mob Deep and Alchemist album on March 4, 2015, acclaimed rap duo Mob Deep, Prodigy and Havoc surprisingly announced a collaboration album with The Alchemist. They posted a tweet and also a picture that announces it too. No more details were revealed yet. Untitled project with Rock Marciano in an interview with Rock Marciano about his recording process, he mentioned that he and The Alchemist are working on a full-length album together. On a Reddit Q&A with Gangrene that took place on August 14, 2015, Alchemist said in an answer to a fan's question about this project and a sequel to Covert Coup that he can neither confirm nor deny this project. I can neither confirm, nor deny that either of these projects exist. Maybe they do. Maybe they don't. I'm into the periodic chart. My favorite element is surprise. Topic. Personal life The Alchemist was born Alan Maman in Beverly Hills, California. His father is a businessman of Israeli descent. On July 13, 2005, the tour bus carrying Eminem's entourage including rapper Stat Quo as well as Alchemist swerved off the road and turned over. Alchemist was treated for broken ribs and a collapsed lung. Topic. Musical signature 
The alchemist utilizes a musical signature that he places towards the beginning although not always of many of the songs he produces. The signature is a distorted voice recording of rapper Prodigy saying, Alchemist. In the distorted recording, it sounds much like A A A A A Alchemist. Equals equals discography.